Hello YouTube! Another week, another Mikado VOD review, another tournament here is fresh from Takadanabo Mikado Arcade from Shinjuku, Tokyo. Um, I think we're starting out pretty soon here, but but uh, just to recap, right, this is the... And yeah, I think um, they're already like, gonna start out our first matches, I think like they said Penny Ban Ban and Integral. Uh, but I think, I believe this is the... Uh, 10th or 11th, um, 10th I believe, unlike the Amikado series of weekly tournaments to celebrate and line up with the new anime, right? Which, though, the anime is only going to be, I think, like 11 episodes long, 12 if you count, like episode 0. So I think we only have two more weeks of this after this episode. Um, so unfortunately, the, you know, all good things come, come to an end, which is a shame because I've been enjoying these a lot. However, um, I'm hoping that, um, you know, when and if the anime, well, not, not if, like when, I hope, the anime comes back for like another core, Mikado might do this again, so I'm hoping like like, like we will see that, right? But for the time being, let's just kind of blessing and be happy that we do have this, and we'll have it for at least two more weeks, I believe. But just uh, as a reminder for anyone who might be jumping in here for the first time, these tournaments are set up so that, like, these tournaments like are typically a round robin, and they're, and they're set up so that you're only allowed to play Katas like in the new anime, which honestly is pretty much everyone in the game, right? Almost everyone in the game is just like, like the Nisei characters, really. So it's not, a, like, not very restrictive. So we've seen like a lot of pretty normal characters over like these weeks, weeks of weekly tournaments. All right, it seems, it seems like we're getting started. All right. So yeah, I think this intake law, Penny Bamba. Okay, yep, here we go. Intake law, Ashura Man, and Penny Bamba, Black Hole. They're saying, you know, a six oh my God, one of the six devil knights versus one of the seven devil children. see it. I think we've definitely seen, seen these two players play together, like the... My nice thing about like the round robin format that they've been doing recently is that you do get to see more matches between all the players, right? Which is like kind of a great match for Benny Banban there to avoid like the rope bounce, but doing power goals for some reason. Oh, great launch, but no juggle, well, not really real juggle, but no tech from uh, Integral. Oh, Integral gets the body, like the tackle into the juggle. Nice. Solid juggle. Ooh, goes for the OTG. I don't remember seeing Integral ever going for that. Okay, I don't know if he just like learned or, or what about it. They decided to go like start, 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 start going for it. All right. Okay, guys, the rope bounce. There's Integral's rel old reliable Ashura is in a drop, and with Black Hole's low health, that was more than enough to kill. Very nice for a round for, from Integral. Then, oh, yep, there's Black Hole's Cobra twist hit grab. Very strong, very invincible move. And the cartwheel got gets hit, uh, connects into the special throw. Again, very standard black hole stuff. Oh, raw 5s into like a while running A for the knockdown. I don't know if that's intentional, but the guy gets the rope bounce into Ashura is in a drop. Let's see the OTG. Hey, hey there, it, there it is. Oh, but gets it by the wake up throw. They got kind of a ropes here, but the kind of uh, a bar a tornado hell worse, but just the combo, like the combo that will have been game winning, unfortunate. Okay, they got kind of scrambling, you're trying to get like the last hit. A desperation move also from Penny Bandman's side, like no meter on his end now, but this isn't doing like, a lot of damage. I think like the, the, the can you say that too? Oh, but just the super and this is enough to kill. Because I don't, supers are not skilled during regular KD, so this is skills. Wow. Very unfortunate round there from... Integral, like, just kind of head in the bag, but then drop like a like, 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 game-winning combo and allowing Penny Bandman to make this comeback. Okay, Penny Bandman getting like, making the card wheel. Not probably a misinput, like getting like the Sasquatch throw. Probably going for like uh, 60 to 140, I guess. I forgot like what input was of like his uh, good throw. Oh, um, that. Okay, gets the... Uh, heavy stun into the launch, gets the juggle. Not going for an OTG still, but just like reposition. Gets a robot throw. Oh! And they all was like, he dropped it. At the, I think he dropped it anyways, even before updating the month's um, ticket activation. But I think like, he was doing like the Ashraman Arcade Infinite. Yeah, yeah, they go breaking out kind of like these Ashraman like combos that I've not seen him do before. Very nice. And then, yeah, the Ashraman is gonna drop enough to close it out. Very nice. Okay. 
This looks like a new integral. I want to see if he's able to like land like 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 infinite. Uh, more during today's day. QVK and Zaha up next. It sounds like QVK was the random wild junk man from like the uh, the theme battle video. Which, incidentally, I think like, like like just went up when I was like recording this. So if you're watching this now, you should be able to see like the first time that like like the theme battle they're talking about. Like it's a really cool video, uh, theme battle. But yeah, Zama first playing Kenny Command and QVK, like the very out, out of the nowhere, but very but surprisingly very very competent, very strong jumpman player. So let's see it. Zama, Kinikuman, and QVK. Shut the man. And yeah, I think like Twitter confirmed to me that his name is QVK, like letter Q, letter V, letter K. So yeah, I think it's the first time in one of these because I think his first, his quote unquote debut match. As was like the team tournament, like the team battle, um, on uh, during like last Saturday. All right, good tech from Zama. QVK is able to get him started and didn't confirm that. Okay, because the robots here from Zama into Gojin hanging. All right, into the uh, some OTGs. Gets it's like a raw launch. Okay, Zama getting like the. Um, what's the curtain into the Kiniku Butcher here? Yeah. The Master Curtain juggle there was really good for Zama because it keeps the, because it doesn't side switch on like 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 as you hear you can get like a like slightly less damage if you don't get good, good for the OTG but a lot better positioning for Kinikuman. All right. Oh yeah, great match from QVK to avoiding like like, like that combo like like like, like, like the layer one Kinikuman scrub killer and QVK has proven like you can kind of avoid that. Very nice. Okay, good tag from. Zama? Get... Okay, uh, but then like here we keep getting like this pressure in, but not, not converting into like a lot of damage. Probably because he doesn't have the meter for it. But he is slowly racking up like this damage though. Oh, full meter from. Oh, yes, yeah, stops like the uh, special throw and gets him with like the throw that leaves him standing. Alright. Much better run there from QVK. Very fast round too. QVK definitely like once he gets like the momentum, kind of just like runs with it. The way 5S gets the ball running A at least. Oh, gets like the, the launcher. Okay, very clean. Muscle curtain juggle. Good position from Zama. Gets the heavy stun and still was able to combo in Kiniku Buster. And I don't think this. Does this kill with the OTG? No, 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 it doesn't. But very close. Any hit will do it here from Zama. But QVK is fighting back. Kind of just using kind of like jump as good buttons, good special moves, good pressure. Um, and uh, Zama kind of just sitting pretty, knowing that any hit will basically well do it. Though QVK has kind of closed his gap, and Zama goes for Muscle Spark. And that's to, you know, to close it out. All right, very aggressive game from both players. Again, QVK, glad to see him back after like, like, like that team battle. Mochink and Hepoko, all oh, right, Hepoko is indeed still here. Mochink, we shall see who he plays. Um, I think he's been playing on like, Baking Man a lot, hasn't been working out for him. I think he mentioned on Twitter like he's playing someone else, I forgot who he mentioned. Like he didn't mention who, but I just like didn't really remember, which is probably better for me, so we can be surprised. That's right, he did say Atlantis, and of course Hepoko, Everett Entertainer, is going for Robin Mask. So yeah, I think, I think Mochink is playing uh, Atlantis this time, which... I don't even know if that's actually like up and like going up the tier list, really. Like you, you, you might have to be like, going down like the tier list there, Mochi. But you know what? Let's see how this works out compared to the previous Banky Man pick. The Heboko, of, of course, is the guy, right? So this is will always be like after that. I don't, I don't remember Heboko. Like I don't remember seeing Heboko's like Robin Nash recently. So let's see how that will, will, will look like. Actually, like, like I'm kind of loud here because I was turning it up earlier for something else. So I'm gonna turn down slightly. All right. Jab string. Oh, that's the heavy stun no blocking. Oh wow. Yeah, okay, good pressure here from Hepoko. Not even like do anything like too fancy here yet. Just kind of going for like basic Robin pressure uh, sequences. Oh. Hepoko, I think like trying to get like this like combo to pick up off of like I know I will fire. I think I've never seen that before. I, I, I want to. I can only see Hepoko like what well, I don't know this because I don't think I've ever seen like this route. Like, I see all my Hepoko's cooking like, with this route. I don't know if it's real or not, and I want to see if he's able to do it. Okay. I was Mochi getting like the road bounce into the St. Helens eruption, into the two-way. Oh, the side switch throw is very, very weird. Okay, good blocks, he gets the launch. Oh, but didn't dash up and also like got the combo anyways. Oh, okay, that's like one of another like better buttons, not like, like kind of like claw, like, like jumping claw type. Got like the heavy stun. 
All right, gets a throw, but I thought that doesn't really have great throws, especially like doesn't really give very good positioning or DGs. Like he has a few, but most of them are like walk behind, like confirms and stuff like that. So like, like something can do really cool. Okay, uh, that said, really good lively here from Moching. Let's see if we can carry that to victory. Okay, but Havoco going for the rebound, super very brave here. Of course, like there's like a huge um like life swing, but yeah, just like that, right? Any hit will do it there, and now, now Hippoko basically spent all the meter for, like last round for no reason because like he not was able not able to close out the round. All right, Robin. All right, what do we do here from Hippoko? Good tech as usual. Good punish, like that's the optimal Robin punish. Especially like as my is Hippoko going for the Robin course of death. Oh, but this is like the remaining extensions. I think. Was Mojang dead if he would finished that? I don't, I, don't, I, I don't think so. I think it was still kind of short. Oh, but that going for like the not real combo. But you know, if, if they don't tech, every combo is real. And the draw, the famous Robin Jeffrey was enough to close it out. All right. Valiant attempt from Mojang for sure. But um, Mojang was able to close it out. Integral and QBK. Okay, so I guess only six players today, I guess. Just to explain like why, I guess spoilers, spoilers the video is kind of like I think like pretty short length, um, and I believe um, they're also doing them like first to two again, like like first to two again. I think like for the past few weeks they've been doing like first to three. So yeah, integral and QVK, Shraman and Jumpman. All right. さあ、アシュラマンとジャンクマン、実際どっちが強いのということで期待したいこの試合。インテグラルアシュラマン対キュービー系ジャンクマン。次。マリポーサにやってましたっけ。まあでもあのマリポーサとロビンの試合も良か
Um, and it's like definitely like a rough spot to be because now Benny Bama have no meter, which definitely gives a lot of black holes and more notable pools. Now kind of leaving him kind of just like a overall pretty meter together, and like that Trojan hanging just will not have the slightest. Two three five, two three four, OT, four six OTG was not pull it up. All right, pretty dark, pretty, pretty rough first round there for for Benny Bama this turn. Um, like this game. Let's see if round two is any different. Okay, Benny Bama like getting like good parries here, but again not able to get, get any started. Like just like not really doing any real hits to Azama so far. Ah, and it's like the Rocky Nick was. I, I think this is dead. This is yeah. This is like with OTG like this is super dead. For Benny Bama, yeah. Oof. Unfortunate. Alright, next up, let's see. Alright, listen, ready. Um, then I guess it should be Hepoko. Oh. We're still, yeah, we're skipping, I guess, head a little bit because, like, maybe, like, players aren't available. So, Integral and Hepoko up next, it sounds like. They even said Integral Ashura Man and Hepoko random. If Hepoko is going for like a war matchup, maybe we must see a 20 Terry Man? Or Sunshine? Sunshine? Okay. We're having like the bromance battle, I mean, I guess. Unless we'll see. We'll see if uh if Evoco locks in on Sunshine. Sunshine, alright. Evoco going sunshine. Probably picking like, the Tournament Mountain. Yep, there we are. Priest! Um you know on hindsight, like it's very pretty strange, right? Like this like this game, like for an arcade game, but you like just choose stages like that. Like like it's a very like, unusual feature for an arcade game. That's, but you know, it's nice. Like you can't complain about having more features. Alright, Hepoko Sunshine against Integral's Ashura Man. Oh, the the four, the three were anti air, very nice. Good stuff on like the five S. Okay, oh, as always, great match from Hippoku, kind of preventing like the road bounce. And they have been like very fond of that, so let's see if uh, um, he's able to like, you know adjust to kind of like Hippoku's defense. Oh, that was a kind of like cheeky. Mixed up from Hippoku. And then the combo because Sunshine doesn't really have ways to. Oh, yeah, that was supposed to combo, but didn't get the combo, but it doesn't matter. But the rope bounce and to uh, throw the combo, but doesn't combo. Yeah, here. Hippo, yeah, Hippoku like, got like bullied there with like the top. Like, it's kind of like a like, corner. Sunshine's like a large size, makes it like, so difficult to avoid. Like, respond to like uh, in a very clean way. And on the top, very good. Okay, yeah. Um, they're going to get like, like, started here, but I think Hippoku, like, just kind of an army clad defense. He's kind of poking him with, like, good sunshine tools, like the, you know, dash up, run up, uh, tops. It's like slowly racking up, like, 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 the damage. Oh, never mind. There's the sunshine, there's the sunshine infinite. Two infinites! Two in and then, like, in, in, in the super. Two infinites, uh, so far, this tournament, right? Which is not a lot, but, but, you know, if I had two penny, uh, if I had a penny for every infinite, right? Like, still happen, like, like, happen twice, especially after, like, I haven't seen any of them all this time. Mochi and Penny Man up next. Alright. So, this should be. Uh, Atlantis and Black Hole? I guess so, yeah, there we go. Atlantis and Black Hole? Atlantis, who are most of them in the new anime. あの、原作だとね、あの、ブラックホールがバンバン新しい気づき入りきくるじゃないですか。あれ、あそれはあったんですけど、なんか全員からあれは面白かったです。アニメアニオリですあれ。さあ、そんな感じのどう問題決。え
Watching gets like the health and which unfortunately gives like, like no, the use that 8 was just completely pointless. Um, and then Ivan Ban starting to get the those cartwheels into special toes and such. Okay, he gets a rope bounce into a 5S. Okay, we're going for the raw special throw. Very common method of bronze offering when you have like land bars. Especially because it's like really hard to deal with and, and often like just really out of nowhere. Okay, good blocks. Uh, no, despite like the early great start, single momentum for Penny Bun Bun. Uh, actually, no, he's still. It still kind of has like the lead though, you know. Uh, Mochin definitely like still fighting on, still definitely like hanging in there. Oh, but that special throw will definitely make it pretty dangerous for Mochin. Like, like like not a lot, a lot, a lot to work with. For sure, the armor either the two way. Oh, did you like line up to kill nine bars on Mochin's pot though? Did he just like take it for the next round? Yeah, he does. All right, final round with Mochin with four bars. Many man one with like. Well, three bars now after doing like the Cobra Twist. We're trading a wake up throws into a two way. Okay, we're blocking the cartwheel. Great interrupt from Mooching. It's one of those things where like you can't let Black Pole get away with the cartwheel too much, but unfortunately, misses the combo in the special throw. Okay. Great jab. Okay, that was not, that was like jab thing, like not very high damage, but it is like a natural thing. Okay. Well, this, this does force um, Penny Bunman to activate here, but let's see like what, what that achieves, especially like now that it's over. And they just like have to basically like slow up, like slow your rapid damage. It's very tough with Black Hole not having meter. Okay, there's a cutter. Oh, Mrs. Dynamic Baker. But then the jab was enough to kind of close it out for Mochi there. So Mochi takes one, take, takes it over Penny Bunman. Okay. Yeah, Zama versus Integral. So this is Kidney Con vs Ashraman, very classic matchup that we've seen multiple times in these weekly tournaments. Alright. The the pub zone skinny one. Okay, Zama Kidney Kuman, Integral, Ashraman. See ya. Alright, going for the sky high stage. The I forgot what this is. Like this is the force up stage like that. I don't remember. Okay. We had launch. Go for the basic juggle. The first blood for integral. Okay, good tech from Zama. Like, like, I was looking for that, like, road bounce throw. To, like, his usual, um, special, like, you know, road bounce special throws. But, uh, Zama doing a pretty good job kind of keeping it, um, like, in the corner instead of, like, cornering you as a random. Okay, yeah. That was a weird ender. Just kind of allowing it, um, take out the tech and now drop the combo because, like, like it's not It's axis. The block from Integral gets the robots this time into special throw. I think they should be enough to kill with the OTG. I'm just with the OTG. Oh, wait, no. Yeah. Oh, I was off. And Guts responded by the super, anyways. I guess, like, that was coming to this curse. I called it with kill, it didn't. And now, the girl is done again. He does have, like, like, 9 meters again, though, so he can just, like, try again, I suppose. Okay, there's the, there's a not super tornado. Into the OT, enter the OTG, but this is the OTG. Zama goes for, for another Rocky Niku Buster for significant damage here. Great, hey, yep. Launch, and then we're doing that. Okay. 8 meters on. On uh, integral side, so like, 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 like he has stuff to work with here, but like, Kiniku Buster was just enough to close it up for Zama. Alright. Let's see who is next up. 
Hi, what's Once again, QVK, 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 it sounds like. Hi. So yeah, Mochi's still thinking with Atlantis, I'm assuming QVK playing Jumpman. I, like, the Jumpman of, um, aficionado, it, it seems like. They're going straight inside Warsman's body. Oh wow, they're Australian. Who knew? Okay, an early 5S from uh, Mochi. Uh, you kind of feeling a little bit, but gets him with the uh, weird kind of, kind of weird get beat back on like the, the raw special throw. Okay, and Atlanta is again doesn't do like, a lot of damage that we see here. Uh, Mochi is like, 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 like slowly wrap the damage, but of course, like, there's always an uphill battle with this character. And QVK uh, is more like something just kind of like, like sweep at the floor every now and then, kind of just doing very local middle moves. But he's still kind of win, like, ahead of uh, life despite everything. A bit, more, a bit less so here, especially like now with like this heavy sun throw. Okay. That's the gap string there into Rob. There's the little throw and uh, UVK takes like, the first round in, in a slugfest. Water ball. I'm gonna go through the first water ball we saw Mojin use. It is uh, definitely a. Not amazing uh, fireball. And UVK is also like, getting like, I think, like, a lot more OTGs than like, he's supposed to. Like, there's two ways I think I can't do it on all these different throws. Okay. Okay. Another kick off from, from, from Jumpman. Good match from Mochi to uh, avoid it. One, oh yeah, it's forced to like pop KKD, but yeah, that's not like a KKD, so it doesn't get to like do the cross cut of the spam, so instead just gets thrown and that's the end of the game. K KVK picks it over, Mochi. Okay, it's only time for Penny Bamba and Hippoko. Penny Bamba in the back hole, and who's Hippoko playing? I mean, like last time they, they played, Hippoko was playing a Pent Pentagon, I believe. Let's see if that's the case. Or well, let's see if it's. Uh... Maybe Kuma or, Ter or Terryman, I guess? Maybe? Oh, the, the, the two different turns. Okay. Hippoko <laughs> going for a second. Like, Kindy Kuma and Great a second. Terryman incognito. Because these two definitely, like, well, then we like, the first that you um, like the first Kindy Kuma Great had a fight with Black Hole, but I guess it's Kuma's, right? <laughs> さあ、どうなるか。あ、そっか。あれだもんね。一応そうか、タッグ編でもグレートとブラックホールは一応カメハメ、カメハメでしたけど、戦ってますね。確かにね。オッケー、8A。8A。まあでも、みんなね、シレ
逆転していくグレートロープに来て、yeah. ワンツーバウンス、and into another <laughs> dirty fight then <laughs> Another slow, like slow inch, but surely h i p o k o chipping away, like chipping away not just at, at any b a m a n s health but also as meter, and then like just, yeah, the Jap Shin CC, the super was not to pull it out Alright, and Boko takes that one. A bit like to no one's surprise, I guess. Mochin k a n t a Integral, alright. Atlantis, a s h a r m a Oh, I guess we're still waiting on i n t e g r a l They're there. All right. There it is. Plant this against a s h u r a m a n We're going on the suspended. Raining stage. Perry, dirty fight, s t i c r e t o Zashki, Zashki, Nu, San, Niakuje, Subatato, Arezo, I must. I guess I'm Terry, no Tyson, I take you, ne, Hamas, Rudy, I say, Dare to the Gans, Kane, Kitai, Say, 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 So, uh, but you know that o n l i n e they go like to the chance to challenge despite being hit the j a p s t r i n g So it, was, it is zero hit. I'm trying to make like some really fat, decently fat buttons. Okay. Again, the, the jab thing that, uh, they all get in the bottom like a scale of, but I think you can hit like five S's here. Oh, that's a rope bounce. Of course, we're going for the usual. Oh, I think like, that was meant to be like the infinite, but uh, Integral drops it. Oh, and that's a wall. Like, hey, and some kind of some kind of tech. Hey, a t a rope bounce. Like, you get that this time, and that should be the end of the round. Yeah, they're not taking one round over Mochi. Let's see if Mochi can pick up any. I guess like, he did win like that one round against Zao, against uh, sorry, Kepoko. But um, let's see if, if let's see if Mochi can pick up like, another win. Today, hey, yeah, almost nine bars to work here for like an actually like not nine bars to work here for uh Mochi and then. Just do it for the special throw, which I, said, I think I've seen that in a lot of videos, it's not very good. Okay, another rope bounce, another. Sure, he's gonna drop, not enough to kill, but very close. Okay. It's kind of like sidestepping, kind of like trying to be careful to not be hit here. Oh, but uh, Integral got go, go, go out him that time and uh, forced to activate, but Integral was ready and the throw was not called it out. Hepoko and QVK, alright. Hepoko or QVK? QVK, Warsman and Hepoko playing only God knows what? Or who rather? Okay, QVK Jumpman and Hepoko maybe going Robin Mask? Okay, Hepoko going Robin Mask. Let's see it. We saw a bit of.、Um, yeah, we saw, we saw a bit of like、uh, Hippoko's Robin earlier because Hippoko also picked Robin against、um, Mojinx's Atlantis. We're doing a bit more aggressive here, especially with this like. Kind of daring Robin Special first into the 8 8 2 that worked. Maybe like it was like a. Maybe q v k i l l e wasn't even aware that you can reduce it like that. Okay. It's not a full knockdown. Gets the, gets the road bounce into the throw. 2 a was not a full to kill. 
いやロビン強っ、right. ジャンプマンに何もさせないでおっ、ジャンプマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマンマ Oh, I'm gonna roll mounts. Wait, another throw. But pretty even now, it's kind of anyone's game. Oh, great tag. Ah, but. Yeah, Hepoko gets the arm bridge. Yeah. Very valiant time there, though, from uh, QVK. I think like almost took a round there against uh, Hepoko, of all people. Game over. Uh, those like matches, but that's kind of like the good thing about Nagato. I guess Sama and Mochink, all right. We're getting to some of the heavy hitters now. Yeah, I guess right now on YouTube, apologies. Like if I sound kind of out of it, it's been kind of a long day, so apologies for that. But Zama, can you come on? Mochink Atlantis. Oh. I think they said like this is like, like last match already. Wow. Time, time do be fast, I guess. Or did they misspoke? We'll see. Alright. Zama, Kinikuman, Mochi, Atlantis. Okay, we lost the slide. Oh, okay. yeah, great text here from Zamo Saka, kind of taking like early attempts from Mojang and keeping him kind of, kind of more honest. Wow, surprised like Chojin hanging me from there. Very nice into the OTG. And just like that, um, Mojang was really like lost half, half his life. Okay, Mojang gets before the Saints Helen, Helen's server eruption. But it, yeah, not, not really a lot of damage like, without any OTGs. And then, likewise, like this is like one of. Um, uh, can you come on? Like, we're a little bit, it doesn't matter. Uh, Zama's still able to hold it out. One more round for Zama, I guess. Or let's see if Mojin can put out a fight with, with, with uh, Atlantis. Okay. There, you see Mojin representing, like, you know, uh, that is like actually pretty decent buttons. Though, of course, as you see, like, they do like a lot of damage, so he, he is kind of like, he doesn't need to hit you a lot to really like, have like the damage. Okay, I guess another raw Trojan St. Hel Mons and Helens eruption. Do you get like, like that much damage comparatively? I don't think, I don't think like another Mount Helens like, will kill here. And the Kinniku Buster will do like a huge chunk. I think with the OTG, this might be enough. No, just barely. And gets hit by the wall running A. Very, very sad, very unfortunate. Oh,ペニーバンバンさん対キュービケじゃん。ペニーバンバンさん対キュービケじゃん。ペニーバンバンさん対キュービケじゃん。ペニーバンバンさん対キュービケじゃん。ペニーバンバンさん対キュービケじ
I like the, the jump crush, the, the jump throw, like that, a huge amount of damage, like a lot of kill with the OKG. Uh, I'm staying alive, but QBK, like any little straight hit will do it. Uh, just like that, like the wake up kick. Very common, they just kind of come in just like lose their wake up kick because like, like they can think about everything else, they just forget about the wake up kick. Oh, that, that time, I mean, I'm gonna try to like. Or again, like, uh, they had like Ross for, uh, for special throw, but that didn't work out. Okay. Oh, there's a talking about Black Hole's Lucha Libre influences. Uh, and again, you're seeing Japan Man slowly rock and damage, of course, like, kind of, kind of, um, common theme, like, with Lucha Libre, kind of, like, have to, like, slowly rock the damage instead of being able to, like, do big that bursts of damage the same way a lot of others can. Oh, but very out of nowhere, we got the Shadow Clone execution. I mean, it's a kill, all right. And he's been staying alive or not, at least not around. Okay. Okay, yeah, Kobe was out there, like, didn't get the hit. Was able to just still kind of like, use it very, very I'm expensive, but very safe on top of Throw and again, we're seeing like the usual black, black hole game plan just kind of harass the opponent, slowly build up damage on them. But like a big good hit, like a lot like that, can be catastrophic. Like, not the end of the world here for Penny Bun Bun, but can be very close, especially after that. Yeah, so QBK, QBK take, takes it. QBK, right? QBK, I, 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 I think I keep saying QBK, but I think it's supposed to be QBK. I might be wrong. Maybe it's QBK. I don't. I don't. I don't know. I mean, he's gonna keep, keep calling him uh, QVK until I remember. That might have Oko. Okay, this is like the last match on the court card, I guess. That might have Oko, Kinikuman, and whoever, I guess. Kinikuman probably like fought half the chat, so it's always like a toss up with Oko. Oh, is Hepoko going for Super Fins? Alright, Hepoko going for Super Fins and Zama's Kinikuman. Let's see how Zama's Zama with Kinikuman fares against Hepoko's Super Phoenix. How many Canada have you seen Hepoko play several times? Back in the day, I think he will frequently drop some important combos and kind of just like lose games out of that. But those seem to be like mostly gone since like he's been returning to Mikado. Right. Okay, all the parries here. As long as like a the AOTG there. Oh, there's the axe kick, there's the pickup misses like like didn't get like didn't even like then the archer it looks like. But that was basically like, like just like all the way the right combo. Oh, the two FS, one A for like the easy knockdown. Okay, he's like that actually like didn't get like the combo properly, but you know, was able to do a significant chunk of damage. Okay. And Hepoko eating this Kiniku Buster after like Yeah. Great a over the throw. Okay, Hepoko going for for Mana's wave, like very Hepoko move here, and then the run up throw worked out. Round one going to Hiboko. Let's see if we can close out the tournament with just like one more round or if Zama like shows fighting chance. Great for success again. Oh, there's the co that's a couple of times the other day where you kind of like do the fart to kind of like drain some of the meter. Unfortunately, he made it like they do Yuri. And so this allows Hiboko to like, like get a combo on him here. And oh, misses like the extension. And we'll continue the pressure, anyways. I think Zama has a lot, like a lot of respect here for Hiboko Super Phoenix. Kind of just like very scared to like really commit to anything unless he just kind of get. Punish severely, gets the robot into Kiniku Driver, though, which I'm not sure it's real, but, you know, let's roll with it. Hit A. Okay. 25S. Oh, but just the insanely fast mash from Zalma translating back into Super, like, 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 just so good at this game. And just like that out of nowhere, like, Muscle Revenger closing it out. Sorry, this is Zama and Heboko. Yeah, it's Heboko. It's the very efficient mashing under the heavy stun and then just let the super rip. 
to close out the game against Zama. Very good showing from Hippoko as usual. Um, and I hope to see him in more stuff, which I think he will do. Yeah, that was the tournament, and I don't think like they're doing any casual for once. I think it seems like it just ends there. So just like that, like like that is all they had for Kinikuman on at the time of um, me doing like this recording a day after like the tournament. So, mm. so yeah. It's a lot of fun. I'd be glad to like watch a lot of like, weekly tournaments, and I hope you all have been as well. Again, they won't be they won't be with us for much for much longer, so enjoy them while we have like we are while we are right. Grab them while they're fresh. Grab them by the bag full. All, all that stuff. But um. <laughs> all right, that is kind of it for the tournament. Uh, so yeah, hope you all enjoyed that. They're just kind of talking, and unfortunately, I just don't like understand enough Japanese to understand. But uh, uh, yeah, hope you all enjoyed that. And uh, if you do, you know, leave a comment. If you like content like this, I know like this is like a very common style of content that I make, but I know like a lot of people like do so and um, watch this. So if you enjoyed, you know, leave a comment. Tell, tell, tell me if you want me to do something different with them, I guess. Um, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. I appreciate you all for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Again, uh, we should have two more of these weekly tournaments before um, they're... It's not on schedule anymore. Because like, like that should correspond to when like the last two episodes of the Kinikuman anime is airing. right? So I'll see you all later, YouTube.